Pac-Man episode 4. Two segments that are way too spooky. The first segment is Pacula. They really went there. Um, typical Stormy night, graveyard uh, episode opening, and then part way through, Mesmeron creates Pacula using a very Frankenstein esque um, contraption. Um, and from there, the episode goes crazy. Mainly because, A, there's a Star Wars ref, not even a reference, a Star Wars parody within the episode. Um... They had already made references to George McPack. Well, they said stuff like George McPack, Thomas Pack Packerson, um, JJ Pack the Third. They had a Skeller Pack. They had a Skelly Pack. Man, this episode was too spoopy for me. Holy shit. Um, and then after the... After the creation of Pecula... Um, it turns out that Pecula... Who has the accent, by the way. The classic... Bleh! We run to Zack your blur type of deal. Um, that was a terrible parody of it. Impression, I mean. Um, it just keeps getting even more insane. But Pecula does not like power pellets. That's the uh, garlic of this world, apparently. I don't get it. Um, there was also a creepy arm that was never explained. It just came out of the swamp, pointed Batman in the right direction, and was never mentioned again. Damn it. In the end, the sun and the pe the power pellets stop um Pacula. Oh and the ghosts, by the way, because they became vampires at one point as well. Yeah, this episode was weird. But not as weird as the second segment called Trick or Chomp. Um, there were quite a few gags in this one. Uh, most of them borrowed from other shows at the time. Uh, uh, stuff like 
I guess it's kind of a who's a who's on first thing with the nows and stuff. Um, there was also they did they did the coyote coyote wily coyote gag from Looney Tunes. They did the cliff ball gag. They just ripped it off for the cat. That cat doesn't deserve that. That gag is better than that cat. That gag, that gag is better than this show. Apparently they thought it was okay. Just like they also thought that the mirror gag, that the uh, fake mirror gag is okay as well. They, they didn't just linger on it for longer than 15 seconds or so. Um, But they did to the gag, which I'm... Even in 1982, that gag is old. <sighs> also, at one point, um, Pac-Man gets told that he's too old for trick or treat sure he shouldn't be getting treats because he's got to be like at least 30 in the show but that doesn't mean he can't dress up Um, there was another skeleton in this episode, in this segment, by the way. So that's two skeletons in the in the entire episode. Both of them end up chomping a ghost. And both of them are too spoopy. Oh, and at one point, Pack Baby, the baby, the child, called Pac Man a chicken. That's a, uh, that's, an, that's definitely worth a, uh, effing chat. <laughs> God damn it. I've become, I've become what I hate. A modern meme. Fucking hell. Um... Other than that, it was just a standard Pac-Man episode, which I hated. So, uh, yeah, see you guys tomorrow for the next one. I just want these to be done. Why do I have to do a week straight of these? And it is quite literally a week of these. Fuck. Be 
Ik ga eens een mooie.